Ooh. It is a scorcher of a day. We have a heat advisory for today. It's gonna be well in the hundreds. Um, yeah, it's pretty hot, but it's so bright and I have my um, screen turned all the way up, but I can barely see because it's just so bright. Anyways, we got the fence finished. It goes from there all the way down there. So we have a decent sized yard. Now we just have gates that we have to do. Um, there's one, two, that big driveway is going to take two, so one, two, three, four, and then one at the back is five, possibly six at some point that we need to install. And then I hung that up. We have a 20 foot flagpole coming, but let's not even talk about that because I am very frustrated with Amazon. And that area probably looks quite a bit different because the wind decided that my little canvas awning should no longer be up and decided to throw some poles to the ground, flip the table, and tomorrow is supposed to be extremely windy. So we went ahead and just took it down. We're not letting the West Texas wind destroy anything else. So it's a disaster now because everything literally went flying. Thank you, wind. I'm gonna just walk back here and check on the chickens. It's really hot, like, wow hot. Make sure they still have water. They go through it so fast, it's ridiculous. They're probably all trying to hide out in the shade. Hey everybody, y'all doing okay? Huh? I know it's hot. Y'all hot? Oh, poor ladies. Y'all okay? I don't even know if you can see them. They're all hiding out in the shade. Anyways, I'm gonna give them some water real quick. I got a new baby. It's gorgeous. Gorgeous. What is this? It's a bug. Get off of there. And then I got this too. My baby collection is growing. Yay. do we go and shop and pick up things to renovate bathrooms that's at least what we're nah, doing dude. Nah, dude. nah dude installed some walls painted some cabinets painted transition and then we had two meetings for um two estimates so it's a busy day now we have to go home and build a duck house all right so we put the littles to bed they're in there and then all the chickens got to go to bed so they're up there and then quackas and cheese always comes over here and hides by the water barrel but they are getting too big for where they've been is a dog kennel. <clears throat> kind of got chicken, chickens, ducks, spur of the moment. Yeah. But they fit fine, but now they have gotten quite a bit bigger. Yeah. Ben is building a duck house. So the duck house is going to be on the outside of the fence. Saving room. So that we're not taking up as much room inside the fence. 
and we're going to just butt it up to the fence, mm -hmm. build the front wall, through, so connect it to it through the fence. This will essentially be like this, connected to this guy, and then <coughs> it'll so have a back door. <clears throat> through the fence. Through the fence. And then that way we're saving space inside the playpen. For all of them. And look at that. Zoom in. Can you smell that? Can you smell it through the screen? That was just cleaned out like, I don't know, two days ago maybe? One and a half days ago? <laughs> yeah. Ducks are just the nastiest. You hear that, quackers and cheese? Hey, quackers and cheese, you nasty. And they love to drink out of those water cups. They're not technically duck cups because ducks have to have water deep enough to clear their nostrils to clear their nostrils. But this is what they do to their water. It's literally mud now. Hey, I would like to say and that had water in it as well. Down. Chickens do help, but chickens don't do that to the water. No, ducks are nasty. And then that was water. And then that was probably water at some point in time or food. Who knows? And that, that that's their food. And it smells really bad over here. It's because of you, Quackers and Cheese. Ducks. 